Aha! And it is... 21 Amethyst, 16 Garnet, 1 Genji Armor, and 1 Ragnarok? Oh my. And here we are. And what is in the treasure chest, might I ask? 33 Potions, 15 Anointment, 1 Holy Mitre, or is it Meter? Looks like it would be pronounced Mitre. And one Dark Matter card. Very cool. Aha, and what have we here? Inside this, the final treasure chest. One ribbon, one rebirth ring, 13 amethyst, and one art card. Very nice. And that, my friends, are the treasures of the Chocograph Hunt. But that is not the end of things, is it? No, there's always something more. Every single time. But what that something more may be... Uh, we will just have to find... Get on there. Okay. Let me see. Because apparently... There is... Ooh, wait, wait, wait a second. Looks like an Eidolon cave. Oh no. Someone told me about this cave. And... I'm pretty sure... Wait, Koopo. It might be some sort of evil boss fight. A strange presence. Is it bad? I've never felt anything like it, Koopo. It's not of this world, but not like a ghost either. Shut up, Nobby. Ugh. It feels otherworldly, Koopo. Time to go and find out. I don't think you should, Koopo. Oh my goodness. Should I or should I not? Oh, why not? Uh, let's just stick with that. Uh, if there's, it's a big evil boss, I'm probably... Yep. Yep, okay. There, no matter who I chose, I would not have... I will not survive this. I can already tell you that. I am not going to survive this evil spinning planet of doom. Because <laughs> that's exactly what this thing is. But if this is an Eidolon cave, if I beat this thing, can I use it as an Eidolon? Time to jump, Ozma. I'm sure this won't insta-kill all of us. Aiko's like, yeah, no big deal. I can, like, summon Phoenix and curse. Well, there you go, then. <laughs> Zidane's the only one who's still doing... Oh! Well, there you go then. It's still, uh... Rebirth Flame. Very nice. So Phoenix still does some nice stuff for us. I was quick enough. Hooray! We get to prolong this fight just a little bit more. Now, if only Zidane had his, uh... His thing. His uh, trance going on. Then I could, uh... I could do Grand Lethal, or whatever it's called. Yay! I'm not even gonna bother healing. Doomsday. Sounds wonderful. <laughs> let's do some thievery. Uh, let's do some Madine. Why not? Uh-huh. What is Cherry Blossom, anyway? Non-elemental damage. See for yourself. What? Oh, okay. And Stano's like, eh, whatever. I've never done EI Strike yet. Let's hit it. Might as well do some damage, huh? Or not. Just kill me right now, please. He's not... Oh, wait, yeah, he is. Steiner's level 44. How did it know what level I'm at? How did it know what level Steiner was at? He's level 44. <sighs> well, there you go. Zidane's death with auto float looks hilarious. Good thing I saved right before I did this. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Georgia64 here, a.k.a. The Hypocritical Gamer, bringing you the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy IX Blind. Ah, and here we are finally here to end the ceaseless dilly... apparently ceaseless dilly-dallying that was the previous three episodes. We're here at Ibsen's castle, and we're here to try to stop 
Kuja from using our planet to do something, probably with his planet, or and probably Zidane's as well. I'm assuming Zidane, him, and Garland all come from uh, Terra, and uh, I don't know, maybe they're trying to use this planet to, I don't know, revive Terra, which is probably like a dead planet or something. Kind of like Cybertron. <laughs> so, is this the old castle Hilda told us about? It looks a lot more peaceful than I imagined. Actually doesn't look that bad. <laughs> What a strange looking place. Like it's upside down or something. Wait, how does it look upside down? I, I don't really see the upside... Unless you're talking about like how it's stone and everything. Whatever. Alright, I'll take three of you with me. The rest of you, secure this spot. Right. Hey, Zedon. Uh-oh. What's up, Omerant? I won't... I work alone. Always have. Always will. I don't know why you bother carrying dead weight all the time. What's your point? I'm saying working alone beats working in a team any day. And I'm gonna prove it. Oh, Amarant. Really? Hilda said there's some key here to break the seal, am I right? Yeah? Let's see who finds it first. First, I'll be going by myself, of course. Amarant, you selfish, ignorant fool. Calm down, Rusty. B but What should I do? Oh man, what should I do? If I let him go, he might find some extra treasures. And if I don't let him go... And if I... But also, he might, like, die or something. Man. Ah. Choices. I don't know what will yield me the best benefits. I wasn't going to use him anyway, I might as well just let him go, as long as it's not a race. Okay. I don't know what you're thinking, but if that's what you want, it's okay by me. Yeah, plus, Zidane's not anybody to force anybody to do anything. Well, aren't you an agreeable fellow? Always has been. Well, see you later. Are you sure about this, Zidane? What can I do? I can't change the way he thinks. Let's get going, everyone. We'll beat Amarant at his own game. Hopefully he finds me some... Like, he does what I, th I was hoping he would do. <sighs> Alright. I really should keep on leveling these guys up. Because... Yeah, these guys are all higher levels than everybody else. Yep, I'll just keep it the way it is. Even though I want Dagger and, and Vivi in my party. Alright. Sounds good. First of all, is there anything besides random encounters out here? Oh, really? I... Okay, well, it looks like I can't do anything over... Yep, okay, I can't do anything over here. Let's just go. No random encounters either. Well, that's good. Eepson's Castle. Ah, that music again. Eepson's Castle definitely has something to do with, uh... The previous place we learned some stuff about Terra before. Oh, oh, haha! -ha. A dagger! Oh, I just remembered! Oh, I totally just remembered! Haha! -ha. I almost forgot! A dagger for Zidane! And. No dispel for Aiko, unfortunately, because we're putting on an air racket. Yup, air racket. And a broadsword for Steiner. And a javelin for Freya. Very nice, okay. Hopefully you guys aren't actually trying to screw me over with that. Aquarius, nice! I'll keep it. Anything else? Uh, no? Sounds good to me. And a random encounter, let's find out. How amazing our lowest leveled weapons truly are. Okay. Oh no, this guy looks evil. He better not kill me. Kill me. A Cerberus? Alright, let's just do a normal attack on Cerberus here. Not bad. Okay. What are you gonna do to me? 
fire, huh? Okay, well, let's just do a quick Kiraga and an attack. Come now. Come now, what is going to happen? Wait, what? Oh no! I forgot that Freya had Reflect on. Man! And I took Dispel off too, so I can't even take Reflect off of Freya. Okay, well, let's just defend with Aiko for now. Ow. Just take him out. There we are. Ah, why does Zidane keep on missing? Is it because he has Auto Float on? If so, then I want to take Auto Float off. Ah, great. Well, now Aiko needs to heal herself. But, before that, we're just going to kill him. I'm going to take Auto Flow off of Zidane. Because, I mean, the only really useful thing that Auto Flow does for you is keep you safe from, like, Earth magic, I'm, I'm sure. Got some Opal, and some level ups, too. I also took level up off of Zidane, because, you know what, he doesn't need it. Anyway, let's take that off real quick. Auto no Auto Float. Instead... I would like to put on Auto Reflect. I mean, Auto Life, but I need another three. Could take Body Temp off. Eh, I don't know. Um, what do I want to put on? Maybe, uh, we'll put on some Killers. How's that? Yeah, we'll put on some, uh, we'll put Add Status back on as well. Cool. Off we go! Any Moogles? Yes, indeed! Alright, cool. Magnet? Ah, oh, Kumul, huh? Well, I have something for you. How unusual. I'm so happy, Kupo. Oh, from Magi to Kumul. Hey, Kumul! How are you, Kupo? Us Moogles and Lindblom are always wondering the same thing these days. Where the heck is Magnet Central? No one knows, Kubo. Do you know where it is, Kumul? It's supposed it's supposedly very far away, and you can't enter very easily. I already found it. I heard that you can't enter Magnet Central unless you're riding a chocobo, Kupo. I'll give you this in exchange for delivery. Ooh, very nice. I need to give that back to that person in Burmacia. Anything else? Okay. How about the Mog Shop? Mage Masher. I already have all of this. Uh uh uh. Oh no, wait, uh. No. Nothing? Nothing really, huh? Tons of potions, that's for sure. Okay then, well, if, uh... If I definitely have at least one of everything. Alright, I tented and I saved it. We're all good here. I don't want to go down that pole quite yet. I want to open that treasure chest over there. Okay, let's take this guy down. I'm pretty sure we've seen this guy in uh, Final Fantasy X before. What's he called? A veteran? Okay. Um, well, let's attack with somebody else for now. Uh, steal from him first. Uh, Steiner attack. Aiko can just defend for now. I don't need Aiko to attack. I don't care about your stupid claws. All right, there he goes. Nothing too difficult here. But do we get level ups? Nope. Got some topaz and a veteran card. Very nice. All right, now back to getting that treasure chest. Because that is what I truly am after. Uh-oh. Oh, look at that sun shining. All right. Get it. Cat's claws. Oh, that could have been for Amarant. Okay. Uh, can I go... Um, oh, I can't. I can go that way. Very well, then. Oh. Well, I've already been here, haven't I? Do not be restricted by your knowledge and experience. This place turns logic upside down. What's big is small, what's strong is weak, and heaven is earth. Interesting. I'll have to keep that in mind. 
If that was only a hint for the weapons, then fine. Oh, great. Well, this is different. I found a stony thing. All right. Let's just attack the gargoyle and see what happens. 46, huh? Uh-oh, what are you gonna do, Agaris? Oh, no. I know it. Oh, it missed. Oh, that's right, because I have body temp on. Haha. Uh -huh. Well, that's pointless. Just take that guy down for now, then. Uh, steal from the gargoyle, actually. Phoenix Pinion, very nice. Uh, hit the Agares. I don't care about your stupid blizzard. Let's go get him. Oh, he's dead. And so is that thing. I wonder what would have happened if we just tra kept on trying to get the gargoyle. I do not know. Alright, Ragtimer card. Oh, interesting. The Ragtimer was that one friendly monster that has nothing to do with the quest. The quiz, the quiz guy, right? Alright, that's nowhere to go, and that's nowhere to go. Okay, off we go. Anyway, let's... Can I go past this Moogle through here? It looks like I can, but I guess I can't. Well then, down... Wait, wait... Can, oh, man, I just thought maybe I could go up. Whee! Let's try again. Aha! I can go up. Or not. Okay. Let's explore. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, great. <sighs> Oh, it brought the gargoyle to life! Uh-oh. So... What happens if I attack the gargoyle now? That it's, uh, not just stone. Take that! I want to kill the Agaris, though. Oh, Will's already dead. Okay, now the gargoyle. Okay, yeah, so now we can actually just take it down like normal. Aerial Slash, huh? I'm not afraid of your stupid Aerial Slash. See? Small potatoes. That really was actually pretty weak. <laughs> Take him down. Almost. Oh, there we go. Alright. Looks like there's... We'll explore places up here for now. Uh, really? Okay, fine. Okay, well, Aiko kind of sort of needs to be healed. Alright, let's go up this ladder. See what it takes us. Huh. Oh, okay. Off we go, then. Nothing to do right there, that's for sure. Alright, getting lots of little helpful summoning stones. That's cool. Oh, what is this? Looks like a button, but I guess not. Oh, okay, so that was a door. <laughs> Aha! Let's go down first. See what it leads. To a random encounter, I see. Alright, let us continue up. Uh oh. Oh man, all these ladders take you everywhere. Except down there. <laughs> Alrighty then. There's just so much. Wait, can I... Uh, yes. Okay. Ooh, treasures! Ah! Uh -huh. Oh, wow, that's an elevator. It takes me up. Okay. I didn't expect it. And the music stopped. Oh, great. There was so much I still had to explore. Uh-oh. You're late, Zidon, and I'm the winner. And what does that mean? See how much time you lose by working with others. Have you figured out how to break the seal? Take a look at the wall. Maybe you can figure it out. But it's no longer my concern. What do you mean? I've proved myself right. I don't need to follow you around anymore. Oh. No way. Am I really losing Almirant as a party member? That can't be. Was I really... 
Oh, that better not be. Enemies next time we meet. See ya. Oh, who does he think he is? It's his way. We can't change him. Let's get going. Great. Oh man, if that is the case, and I'm really mad at myself. Huh. So... Hmm... Let's see... There's something written on it. My power is protected high atop a fiery mountain. Oh! Fire mirror, huh? I think I already know where to take that, like there's a volcano on the lost, uh, lost continent. What about this one? Let's see... This one too! My power is protected underwater, surrounded by the earth. Hmm... That one will take a little bit more thought, I think. What about this one? I mean, this is obviously a map of Gaia, so... Let's see, and this one! My power is protected behind a tornado. A tornado? Does that have something to do with that one place that I can't really walk into on the Forgotten Continent? Don't know... Wind mirror. And finally... Let's see, this means... that means this one too. My power is protected under the shaking ground. I know exactly where to go for that. Awesome. Earth mirror. So I guess, like, they just tell you, uh... Maybe by going to these different locations with the mirrors, I can, uh... I didn't know there were going to be random encounters, but I can find uh, the location of the Shimmering Island. I don't know. Hopefully. But I'm still going to explore some more of Ibsen's castle. Oh, okay. Well, looks like we got what we came for. Came here for. Let's go. Were those writings in a language only you can read? Yeah, they were the same as the ones I saw at Wheelvert. I always forget uh, that it's called Wheelvert. Sometimes, anyway. Not always. Like Hilda said, those things on the wall must have something to do with a seal. Let's think about that later. We need to get out. We better, like... S um, mirror, return to me. I feel like that's a boss who's gonna try to reclaim the mirrors. Who's there? Uh huh. Yup. Jeez, look at that guy. <laughs> Energy flow interrupted. Energy to Terra. I knew it. I totally called it. So there. So like uh, the mirrors were there and they were sucking up energy of, from Gaia into Terra. That is what I'm assuming is going on. You dare to get in the way of Terra's master plan. W what is this? My name is Taraka. Return my mirrors. You should say please when you ask for things. Fool, you'll regret this. All right, let's get right into this. Looking forward to it. Very nice. I'm still a little a bit sore about Amarant. Would he? I wonder if he would have left if we had tried to make him stay anyway. I don't know. Oh no. All right, what's this guy gonna do? Blizzaga? Uh, who care about that? All right, Taharka. Let's see what you have to steal. That wasn't so bad. Okay, and uh, let's summon Carbuncle for now. Haha. Uh -huh. <laughs> Didn't do that much damage, but still. All right, let's see what it does. Carries Aura Calcon, Mithril Claws, and Elixir. Okay, well I really want the Aura Calcon the most. Okay, so see for yourself is the six dragons. Wait, I could have sworn I had something else. Oh, that's right, it was on the weapon. And okay, well let's find out what six dragons does. It does something to us. Okay. All right, let's just a EI strike knocks out the target, reduces the enemy's attack power. Yep, this is just like uh, Orin's stuff. All right, let's take down his defense. Hopefully it'll work. Six dragons. Steel. We want that aura calcone or whatever. Whoa, look at that thing. What? 
What if it's a <laughs> compact? I my why would it do that? I don't understand. I don't get it. I really, really do not get it. Uh, cast regen and all party members. Let's do that. Especially for Heiko and Steiner, who very much need it. Alright, let's, uh... Man! Okay, let's just attack him like normal. Oh, jeez. Well, at least he didn't attack Eiko and Steiner. Man, that... That was upsetting. Got an elixir. Yay! Alright, let's, uh... Kuraga, everybody, specifically me and Steiner. Man, that was upsetting. What else can we do? There's White Draw, restores MP to all pa party members. Um, yeah. Oh no! I forgot about that. What? Oh, that's no good. I mean, it's not like I did a ton of damage to him anyway. I totally missed what I stole before the elixir, so I need to do detect again. Alright, well at least we've got that. Okay, what do I want to do? Open, huh? Let me see, let's... We've got float, reflect, mini, I doubt mini will work on it. Holy, huh? Let's do some holy. Hopefully it does, uh, it does good. Okay. Tell me what I need to know, Zadon. Alright, let's just do just a normal jump. Or a Kalkan. Okay, that's the only thing I need now. I have the Mithril Claws, which that means. I'm pretty sure I already had those anyway, though. Alright. What I wish Echo had was Scam, but only Dagger has that right now. Wow, that was a lot. Okay, let's steal. Steal from this guy. I got it! I got the Oracalcum! Alright, now I can take this guy down. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to, uh, use, um... Oh, what's his name? Uh, Zadon's, uh, trance. I wanted to use Grand Lethal, but I didn't get the chance because it ran out while I was stealing. So that's a real shame. But, oh well, what can you do? Six dragons? Nuh-uh. I'm not gonna do six dragons until I understand better what that really does. Just cast region again. I don't care. Just Let's just wail on it. We'll do a thievery. Hopefully this hurts to Harka. Yay, it hurts to Harka. I'm so happy. Ouch. All right, come on. We can take this guy down. We can do it. Well, that oh oh he's uh, compact into a ball. That's what ha that's what's going on right now. Well, I hope thievery actually works. Otherwise, we should just wait for him to open up again. Okay, well at least that that hurt him a little bit. Ram. Right, come on, just open up. Well. I guess I'll give Aiko an ether while I'm waiting. We'll also do a little jump. Whatever, we might as well just keep on attacking. Hooray! Alright, and... Ooh, Trance for Steiner! Very nice! Thievery again suits me just fine. Let's take him out now. Don't worry, I'm not going to spam thievery, just... Right now, it's the best thing I can think of right now for Zidane. Uh -huh. How to do? Okay, good. It did, it did, it did alright. Um, I don't want to do Madine again. Um, for now, we'll just... We'll put on uh, uh, some more Reflect on everybody. I know you can put different stuff on to make Carbuncle do different things. I just haven't done that right now because I was too busy leveling up ac uh, uh, other abilities that I didn't have yet. 
Yay! Okay. Ouch! Oh, it's dead! <laughs> that was, that's hilarious. 134 damage, and that's what it does. Okay, 11 AP. Not bad. Auto haste encounter and initiative. Lots of gill. Alright, so that guy wasn't too hard at all. I might be a little over leveled, so. One is all. All is one. <sighs> when was Full Metal Alchemist uh, written again? I don't know. You'll never break the seal. How much you want to bet I will? I'll break it, and I'll stop Kuja's evil plan of destroying this planet to save his own. I like this planet. Alright, let's leave. Actually, there might have been something over there uh, that was dropped by the boss fight, so I'm going to go back up there. Okay, so there was nothing there. Let's just go back to the Moogle for now. Oh, okay, there's actually a scene. Oh, no. Great. Are you okay? Uh, of course I'm okay. How clever. We must have activated the trap when we reached the top. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Let's go. They're waiting for us outside. Okay, well, that's... That's interesting. I wonder if I can go down there. Anyway, so before uh, I end off the episode, I do want to check one thing. And that uh, is the Oracalco, or whatever it's called. Here it is, the Oracalcone. The most powerful thief's dagger. Really, is this Zidane's best weapon? Because if so, then that's awesome. The Oracalcon. I like it a lot. But I'm not going to put it on until I officially leave. Anyway, so, oh man. If there's a way to get Amaran back, please tell me how to do it. And if I was not supposed to do that, then whoops. Anyway, um, also, if there's anything worth getting in here right now, uh, let me know and I'll look for it. You don't have to tell me what it is, just basically tell me, yeah, keep on exploring. And okay, I'll keep on exploring, because right now, the only thing in the treasure chest besides Aquarius were a bunch of low-level weapons, and I don't really need those, since I already, I already have them all. Anyway, so, uh, until next time, this has been Georgia64, aka The Hypocritical Gamer. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.